Hey folks, your OS Reviews, you're watching our video first look and the hardware tour of the HP ProBook 4430. This is a fairly lightweight 15-inch laptop computer meant for consumers as well as productivity users that want something extremely sturdy when they're traveling around. It's not going to be the lightest or the slimmest laptop in the world, but it does run fairly swiftly and does have, again, a magnesium alloy construction and some rubber accents going on, which uh, makes it resistant to wear and tear. So taking a quick look at the design here, it's nothing out of the you know ordinary it's pretty generic as far as the design goes but it is uh, fairly standard and there's again that's a two-tone design between the aluminum you can see here with the metal and also the soft touch rubber on um, some places so that makes for a pretty interesting contrast down below on the front here you have access to a full-size sd card reader and there's also two 3.5 millimeter jacks one for plugging in your favorite speakers or headphones and a second one for plugging in an inline remote or a mic uh, if you don't want to use a built-in mic when doing skype or conferencing the sides here features access to two USB 2.0 ports, and there's also a full-size port for the uh, DVD drive, which allows you to read as well as write and burn your own discs. So for a fairly compact laptop, we are excited to see the presence still of an optical drive on board. The default operating system on this can be selected between Windows 7 and Windows 8, which means it's also upgradable to Windows 10. And as far as configuration goes, we're talking about an Intel Core i3 to an Intel Core i5 chipset, depending on the model that you select. And pricing begins at around 550 bucks, which really isn't too bad for something of this caliber, especially if you shop around online and get it for a pretty low price point if you don't want anything too flashy in terms of design, but a laptop that performs very well. You can see the sides here also has a pretty traditional hinge, but it does have rubber accents in addition to that magnesium frame, which uh, makes things extremely sturdy. And there are rubber feet on the bottom, which prevents the laptop from sliding around on a surface or a desk. So let's set this open and show you guys what it looks like uh, as far as the design on the inside, including the keyboard is concerned. So the base plate here is also made out of that same metal material, which uh, makes it pretty sleek as far as the uh, design is concerned. And there is a fairly traditional island style or chiclet style keyboard for HP computers. Something I will note about this uh, Pro Book is that they omitted a dedicated numpad for controlling uh, calculations. So you do have only a traditional number row on the very top. So if that's something that you're looking for, that's going to be a mission. Since this one can be oriented for the professionals, they also built in a biometric fingerprint scanner on the bottom here for added security, which is a nice touch. The trackpad here is pretty oversized, measures in around three inches diagonally, and it's a multi-touch enabled trackpad, which allows for pinch to zoom gestures, and it's fairly swift and responsive. I especially like the fact that HP included two dedicated controls, which are also very responsive for selecting things, as opposed to a more consumer-oriented laptop, which the entire touchpad would press down, and still makes for a slightly awkward experience when you want to rapidly text and select various uh, files when you're managing that. The keyboard here, again, is a full-size keyboard. It's very comfortable to type on. Travel and feedback is good. And after using it for a bit of time, you can get used to it fairly quickly. There's a, a special get dedicated row in the very top for media controls, for playing pause, uh, adjusting the sound files, so on and so forth. And the very top also features dedicated controls for the uh, wireless settings, so you can turn Wi-Fi and Bluetooth on or off, in addition to the power switch. Again, on another nice touch on here is the addition of the SRS premium sound. So you can see that play in with the sound bar on the very top here. It produces a fairly loud and crisp sounding audio experience from a laptop speaker and although it's not the best speaker in the world, it's uh, miles above most of these uh, consumer-based laptops you'll find, especially contrasted to a lot of Toshiba laptops, which have a fairly tinny speaker setup. Otherwise, you can see here the screen here is pretty typical for a 15-inch display. It's not IPS, but it is an LCD panel, and uh, view angles are decent, and I like how they used a matte display here, which makes it still fairly visible under direct sunlight, although obviously it's not going to be as bright. The very top also features a webcam, which is 1.3 megapixels, allows you to make Skype calls and do video conferencing a bit more easily. Performance is what you would expect from a Core i5 chipset. It's pretty swift and uh, quick. And in addition, as far as the RAM is, is concerned, you have two configuration models, one which is set up at uh, four gigabytes, one which is at eight gigabytes, and the hard drive capacity is around 500 gigabytes, upgradable up to one TB. So pretty good as far as the overall hardware specs are concerned. Good enough for some multitasking, for a bit of gaming, file managing, productivity, all those things can be nice as far as you're not d too demanding of the overall processing. Um, so overall, I would say that the HP ProBook 4430 is 
a very you know kind of under key understated laptop as far as design is concerned it has a nice solid uh, amount of specs as far as hardware is concerned underneath the hood which might make it very compelling for users looking for a uh, pretty middle of the road laptop that isn't too expensive but performs well and more importantly has a great build quality. You can check out more details in our upcoming video review but for now this has been our video first look of the hardware of the HP ProBook 4430.